Jennifer, a White House task force finds one in five women is sexually assaulted while in college. Officials say campus assaults are chronically underreported, and that's something that leaders at our own Missouri state say needs to change. But these just aren't numbers. These are our friends. These are our daughters. A report from the White House, part of the administration's new Not Alone initiative, it's up to all of us to put an end to sexual assault, found most victims of sexual assault on college campuses know their assailant and that the crimes are often unreported. That's why the report recommends universities provide better training for victims' advocates, ensure victims' identities remain confidential, and encourage more reporting, and carry out better investigations. It's a devastating problem. Missouri State Dean of Students Mike Younger said the White House's roadmap in the fight against sex assault could bring necessary awareness to the problem. We're not novices or new to this, um, but we are in the process right now of our re revising our code so that everything that we need to do is not only in our heads, but in, in writing. He says sororities, fraternities, and other groups are already making strides to prevent sex crimes and their stigma. Gamma, which is Greeks advocating mature management of alcohol, they are going to have a director for sexual assault prevention. Missouri's own Senator Claire McCaskill, a former sex crimes prosecutor herself who is known for leading reforms in the military, praised the White House's effort today, saying everyone needs to be all in on this fight. The White House launched a new website for this not alone effort. We'll have a link to it on our website, OzarksFirst.com. All right, man.